a piece of music that makes me cry. I mean, I had, I had an experience when I was singing Romeo and Juliet with my wife. And, I mean, the, the tomb scene is, is great music. When they're dying at the end, it's, it's very heartfelt, it's very emotional. But it never made me cry when I watched it from an audience perspective. Um, but then there was a time in rehearsal where we did it for the first time and I entered the scene and I saw my wife laying there on a tomb dead. And I don't know what it was, but it was for some reason it just kind of hit home that that's really going to happen one day. It's one of those things that you never really think about. You know, you never really think about life and death until something really just puts it in perspective. And I just remember seeing her laying on the tomb thinking that's going to yeah, that's, that's gonna happen. And it kind of just got to me. And I was, I was a little choked up in rehearsal, and I, I, it, it took me a little, a little while to get over it. So, I, you know, watching it from an audience perspective never made me cry, but being in the scene and in that moment really got to me. I mean, there are also songs out there that I've heard over and over again, and they make me cry to hear them again because they're so annoying, and I can't stand to listen to them ever, ever again. But other than that, I, I have to think about it a little more.